At the twilight's last gleaming Whose broad stripes and bright stars Through the perilous fight O'er the ramparts we watched Were so gallantly streaming Miss Maddie May, I'll tell you what, God bless America and each and every one of you folks for coming out tonight. We're gonna have a good show. We're gonna start with the best dressed class. It's your job. Uh, gonna start down here. I'm not, 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 not yet. Oh, oh, oh. Don't get warmed up here. You'll mess up the applause meter. Yeah, we need to get the drivers. Car number 14, Craig from Delaware, right here, car number 14. The next car, the Sammy car, M1, Sammy Payton from Delaware. Sammy. All right. Next one, from Ashley in the car number 20, Carl Cunningham in the blue car. Next up, car number 93 from Ashley Eddie Skeens. The winner tonight, car number 14, Craig Keller.
nobody else is. All right. Everybody getting involved in it now. M1 down there is Dana Maltzberger. The cop car there, the guy driving crazy, Ricky Punches. He's having a big time. Number six is Mike Buckren. 36 Double D, Jeff Clark. Uh oh. Number 50 in trouble already. Number 50 having trouble running. Oh, a nice hit. Number six, Mike Buckren with a good hit on the 55 car. 50, the only one, well, 55 got a little trouble now. 50 and 55 in a little bit of trouble. There goes 55. Dana Maltzbarger in the M1. He's running, but he ain't going anyplace. That's not good. idea was set down here. Number 50 is almost out. If he's not, he's on the clock. Dana Maltzbarger in the M1 got a good car, but he can't make it go. He got down there on the wet end, and he is sitting. He's running. The wheels are turning, but he ain't going no place. push. That'll be good. He'll like that. is officially out. That's Ricky Bunches. He's out. Dana Maltzbarger trying to hit somebody. They're, they're circling the wagons now. Clark in a double D car, looking good. Dana Maltzbarger got to be the most unhappy person in there right now. A double D coming after another one. Oh, had to pull out for you to got a driver's door. Good job of driving by Jeff Clark right there. Good job of driving by Double D. Dana Maltzbarger has to go out. Things just weren't working for him tonight. Something the matter with the rear end or something in his car. He's out. We've got one more. He's got to go. 55 is on the clock. 55 is on the clock. 93. Is 93 on the clock also? No. Just 55, 93 is moving. If he can't go, we're gonna have our four. Trying to get her started. Not happening for him. Oh! Fighting right to the end here. Oh yeah. about 
to bite the bullet. That's it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We got four winners. 55 ran out of time, could not get running. Number six. Number 283. 36 Double D. I knew her. No. And 93, they'll be back for the feature. Community College, Myers, M&D Transmission, PNC Bank, Jack Fling Insurance, and Monsanto helping out. First car out for the second heat. Number 905. 905, the first one in is Nicholas Brown from Sunbury. 357 coming in there. That's Dylan Morgan from Bucyrus. 272, Nathan Miller from Chillicothe. 331, Jason Parker from Marengo. 522, Jamie Stidka, Stidham from Russell Point. 14, Craig Keller from Delaware, your best dress. Now, once again, folks, if you're in the aisle way, you cannot be standing up. As far as that goes, if you're any place, you can't be standing up unless you're in the back row. If you're standing up and you're not in the back row, that means somebody can't see. So please sit down. Have a good time. Stay behind the yellow. Four, three, two, one. It's time for heat two. Who's going to get that first hit? Like 357 X with the first hit. Oh, they sandwich your best dressed car. Number 14, Craig Keller. Got it from both sides. Another good hit. They're working out there. Five twenty-two, trying to line up on somebody. Jamie Stidham with a big hit. You can see that one coming. He was lining up. Nice little side swipe there by 905. 331 coming at him. He gets a shot. I think they're trying to dent up that best dress car. That 14, they got him in the middle, and they are... Hammering on him. Frank Keller getting a beating out there right now. He's holding his own. Nice hit down at the other end. Everybody's still running. Everybody's still looking good. Here comes 331. He's looking for somebody to hit. And he found him. Another sandwich job. They're managing to get 14 in the middle on a lot of hits. Getting him from both sides. Oh, we got one stuck on the wall. He's hooked on the wall. Nobody will want to hit him. Oh, there he got off. Everybody's running. getting a little drier, track's getting a little faster, hits are getting a little harder. That's what it's all about. Oh, here comes. Oh, he missed him. Could have had him right in the middle of the track. Oh, here's he's waiting right in the corner of sitting duck. It's like 557 on the clock down there. 557, Dylan Morgan not running. Dylan is on the clock. He needs to get running. Everybody else got plenty of power out there. Oh, 
that we saw Dylan right in the wall. Now, <laughs> talk about adding injury to insult right there. 522 not running now. There he got fired up, I think. There he goes. Boy, he was about out of time, too. All of them running. Everybody looking good out there. That's a rookie driver. He got our got a grit and guts trophy already. They give him a trophy. He's only 18 years old. This is his first derby, and he's looking pretty good. Nicholas Brown in the 905. Rookie driver holding his own right now. Five fifty-seven. Whoa. 557 is going to be out. Still five running good. 522 looking for somebody. He's not going to get anybody though. 905 trying to work around the dead car and get out in the middle. There he comes. He's taking some hits. Got a flat front tire. to hit somebody. They've, he's been touring around the circle there a little too long to see some of the officials. Oh, Nicholas got a radiator hose or something. That's all. That is not smoke. That's steam coming out from the 905 car. I hope. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Oh, two for one. Two for one right there. That might be a mad dog hit. That could be one of them right there. We do give a mad dog award to the best hitter two tonight. Now, right now, that guy's got one in the bag. Somebody don't get it really hot here. He took number 14 out almost. It might be over. He's on the clock, number 14, Greg Keller. If he can't get running, we've got our four. Oh, 9.30. Now, he wouldn't have needed to do that. He did a head-on, did more damage to him than the other guy. They're still hitting, aren't they? Mercy sake. Oh, 522 getting another one of those big runs. 522 is Jamie Stittum from Russell Point. He's coming the link. Here he comes. Hit Oh, he missed him. Look. Oh, he just broke his stick in time. That's going to do it. That's going to do it. Hold everything. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, that guy broke his stick just in time. He was about to say hello and goodbye. 9.05 is going to be one of them that's back. 5.22. Uh, I'm not sure what the number of that is, but we'll, we'll figure them out. I'll get them for you in just a second. Twenty-two will be back. That's Jamie Stidham. Three thirty-one will be back. That's Jason Parker. Two seventy-two will be back. That's Nathan Miller. And nine oh five will be back. That's Nicholas Brown. Your rookie. That is for.
unless you're in the clear back row. Size cars are coming in. Or are these compact? These are compact cars. Number 20, Carl Cunningham from Ashley. 53, Zachary Antrim from Delaware. 78, Drew Schreider from Marysville. Number three from Henrietta, Chris Zercher. Double zero from Richwood, Philip Hall. Tim Jensen from Howard in the zero four. Josh Lupe from Ostrandor, 141.3. Tyler McCarty from Delaware in the 657. And Austin Stickley from Mount Vernon in the triple eight. This is a fight to the finish this time. We're going down to one standing. They're not bringing any four back this time. They're only going to be one running when we're done. Here comes that 14-3. Josh made it. He'll be the last one in. I if you guys are... Three, two, one, it's the time for compacts. My favorite heat right here. Yeah, these little guys are quick. Looking good, everybody's running. Nice zip around there, don't, oh, look at this, nice hit. Look at the double zero with a big hit. He got two of them on that run. 14-3, oh, big hit. Look here, oh, 14.1 did a broad slide. Got a trade heading for the wall. Oh, he got him stopped. 657! <laughs> if, he had, if he had got part of it, he'd have drove over the wall, I think. That's Big John moving. That'll hurt. These guys are fun, aren't they? I love these compacts. 04 with a nice hit. Zero taking or four to the wall, but he doesn't. Whoa! A little help from the number three car. Here comes Porty. <laughs> Spins around and gets it in the nose. These guys got to be having fun, don't they? Oh, big hit down in the far end. He's smoking a little bit. He'll run out of oil before this is over. There is metal bending down there now. Mercy sake. Oh, look at this. Put up a smoke screen. 78 taking somebody to the wall. Double zero getting into it. Everybody's having fun. Well, you could be sitting there in that smoke and not see somebody coming. 
That could sneak up on you out there now. This is way cool. 04 going after. Oh, nice hit by the 04 car. That's Tim Jensen in the 04. 657 with a little hit. Had to pull off the driver door. Oh, he got another whip. 657 is Tyler McCarty out of Delaware. Oh, <laughs> there's a smoke screen. I, I, that's a pretty cool tactic. You make enough smoke, they can't find you. Looks like 78 is out, I believe. That's Drew Schreider. Everybody else, uh, 141, 3 is on the clock, if he's not out. 53 just got walloped by the double zero. Double zero is Philip Hall. And 53 on the receiving end of that was Zachary Atrum, and he's, Antrim, and he's out there going again. He gets it again. Two cars out. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Don't get out of your car. Mercy sakes. Two down and a whole bunch of them. Seven still running. Remember, we're going down to the finish. This could take a while. Looks pretty good, don't he? Triple eight, Austin Stickley. Hey, look at the 04. Ouch. 04, Tim Jensen. Austin Sickley having a bit of trouble with that triple eight. Whoa! Hello. How do you like me now? Ew, that'll leave a mark. That guy was the number three car. Number three over there on the wall. Chris Zercher from Henrietta. He's feeling a little pain right now. No, that wasn't three. That must... Three's up here. I'll find out what number he is. Tim Jensen making a lot of noise out there. 657's in some trouble. His stick's still up. They're still hammering him. He's fair game as long as that sticks up. Triple eight, Austin Stickley. Having some trouble getting running. He's on the clock. The one over on the wall ran out of time. I've got to get that number. It could have been maybe number 20. I don't know. Can't see it from here. Still about five, five live ones. Poor old Austin ain't running too good though. He's, he's cross-eyed. He's got front wheels pointing two different directions. That don't work too good usually. <laughs> Austin Stickley's gonna be out, eight, eight, eight. Got some major front end issues. Then there was five, four running. 
One on the clock. Number three is getting counted down. Pick one out you like. Get, oh, look at the front end problems on 657. Mercy sakes. That wouldn't be so bad, except that's a front wheel drive, I think. Front wheel drive and the front wheels look like that, you got problems. Ouch. Nice hit right there by the number. Who was that guy? 20. One of your best dressed, Carl Cunningham. Oh, 04, Tim Joe, he missed. 53 missed everybody. 20 didn't, Carl Cunningham got a little piece. Six fifty seven's got big trouble up here in the corner. He's a front wheel drive and his front wheel is all messed up. The whole front end shot. Got a tire almost off. It's not flat, it's almost off of there. Oh, Carl Cunningham in the middle of that hit. Four left. Number three going to be out. Number three is out. We got four live ones. Carl Cunningham, 04 Tim Jensen, 657 Tyler McCarty, and 53 Zachary Etcher. Oh, going for a ride now. Tim Jensen, he's giving Tyler McCarty a ride. He's giving him a tour of the track right now. 657 gets a hit out of it, though. He needed to hit somebody and got a little help from Tim Jensen. Down to three. Number 53 is out. 53 is out. Carl Cunningham in the 20. Tim Jensen in the 04. And Tyler McCarty in the 657. Nice hit by Tim Jensen. Nice hit by Carl Cunningham. Six fifty-seven. Tyler McCarty got rid of that tire finally. You don't get too good attraction with just a rim, though. Oh, and he's in the corner. This might hurt if they get him before he gets out of there. Tim Jensen driving like a wild man out there in that 04. He goes, hits one, comes back to the other end, hits the other. No, he missed him. There he got him. It's like Tim got a radiator that last time. He's steaming a little bit. Or a hose. Maybe just getting hot, too. He's wailing away at Carl Cunningham. 657, Tyler McCarty just trying to hit somebody to stay alive. These three are all going to be in the money, so that's the good news. Only one of them going to get the big... Oh, three! All in one spot. And I'll tell you, he hurt the steering on the number 20 car. He got the steering bent around pretty good on the 20 car with that hit. That might have been the hit of the night for Tim Jensen. He might have, might have did number 20, Carl Cunningham in with that. Yes, he did. Carl is out.
We're down to two. Oh, you know what Tim Jensen's thinking. Tim Jensen's going to get a run at him. Tyler's got to see it coming. Hang on, Tyler. Oh. Front wheel drive with the front end bent in like that, I don't think he's ever going to move out of there. He fought and fought, but I think Tyler McCarty is in deep trouble. Tim Jensen got nobody to pay attention to but him, and he is devoting all his attention to him. Uh-oh. Tim hung up on him, but he did have the last hit. Now he come loose. Jensen one more time. Tyler's got to be on the clock and time's got to be running out. That's going to be it. They're flagging them off. Your winner tonight, the 04, Tim Jensen from Howard. Uh, Good fight right to the end in the 657, Tyler McCarty from Delaware. He didn't have much car for a long time, but he made it hang in there. First car in looks like car number 44, Will Parsons, he's from Mansfield. Map is automotive. 04, Tim Jensen coming back with another car. Tim Jensen just won the comeback. He's back with a midsize. I still got a headache. Number 25, Fred Murphy Sr. from Mount Vernon. In the M1, Sammy Payton from Delaware. 730. Fred Murphy from Mount Vernon. It's a junior and senior are both in here. 074, Seth Gibson from Bell Fountain. Number 11, Jason Joyner from Mount Vernon. Should be seven of them out there, and there is. Seven cars going to only one. Only one can be left. One, it's time for the midsize. Oh, 25 with the first hit. These guys are having fun too, look at them. The longer they run, the drier the track gets. The faster they go, the harder they hit. up at this end. They must like it up here. Oh, good hit there by the 730 car. Here comes Sammy Payton right back on that 730 car. Fred Murphy hit him and Sammy Payton got him back. Looks like they got, got something going with each other. Now 730's back on Sammy. Might be a little feud going on here. Guess where Sammy's headed? Right back on to 730. Not taking this personal, are you? I think they're gonna spread the wealth now. They're gonna go get some other folks. Sammy, watch that driver door. I'm sure. Whoa, that was hold it, hold it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold everything. We got a pro. There they go. One of them's not right.
running very good. The guy that lost the axle, <laughs> that'd be 44 down there. <laughs> he ain't going no place without a wheel next one. That's not happening. Peyton with a little combat turn there. side is that 25 over there I think 25 is out they're telling me 25 is gone no that's not 25 what number is he 253 that's 25 up here He's third, okay. Sammy Payton and Tim Jensen. 
What what number is he? Number three? Twenty-five is three, right? Who's four over there on the wall? Seven thirty? Okay. Seven thirty is gonna be fourth. So we're down to two. Oh four, Tim Jensen just won the last one. Oh, Sammy Payton says, I'm done. Tim Jensen goes back to back, wins the compact, come back and win the midsize. Sammy Payton gonna be second. In third, Fred Murphy Sr. Fourth, Fred Murphy Jr. Fifth, Seth Gibson. Sammy going back to shake hands with Tim there, okay. I'm telling you. <laughs> Calls his car Dolly. Scott Drevenak from Columbia Station, 283. Guys are looking good, yeah. They, it's like they got them tuned up and ready. 522, the guy that's won the one Mad Dog trophy so far, Jamie Stittum from Russell Point. He's got the biggest hit of the night so far. Seventy-two, Nathan Miller, a rookie from Chillicothe. He switched cars. You're allowed to do that. He was in at 9.30, got it busted up pretty good. You're allowed to switch cars as long as the car was run in the derby tonight. So he, that's, that's all legal. 93 from Ashley. Eddie Skeens, one of the best dressed guys. 331, the Rebel from Marengo, Jason Parker. Oh, hold it. I was wrong about Nathan Miller. He didn't switch cars and he's not a rookie. This is the rookie. This is the rookie, Nicholas Brown in the 905. There's your rookie guy. Looks like he got a new set of tires and wheels. He's from Sunbury. Sorry about that. I was. I don't blame him. He won't find another trophy like that at a county fair. Look at that baby. Yes, sir. That's what they want. Remember, if you are not in the back row, you do not stand up. People sit down. People behind you can't. Four, three, two, one. It's time for the feature. This is the one we've been waiting on right here. Oh, buddy. Right out of the shoe, 331 with a big hit. 905, your rookie gets a nice hit. He put it right in there, and he takes one in return. He got his front end blasted. Still going, though. All right. All these guys, by the way, all of these guys will get a check tonight. If they qualified for the feature, they're in the money. Only one of them gets the big check, though. And only one of them gets the big trophy. Oh, 93 gets walloped. Our rookie got shook up a little bit, knocked his spoiler off the top. They're still working on him. 905, Nicholas Brown, the rookie, is getting hammered. And he can't do anything about it. He can't go. I don't think he's going to go anytime soon, either, the way it looks. Get runner again, 905. 
93 is the one who's in trouble now. 905, the rookie is getting hammered, but he's hanging in there. 93 is on the clock. Everybody else looking pretty good. Put it in the forward gear, Johnny. He's right. He don't know he's in reverse, I don't think. Maybe that's the only gear he's got. And maybe, I guess he don't have a forward. This not working out for him. Coming around the corner, aren't they? 93 is out now officially, I think. So is 905 out. 522 on the clock. Two down. Six running. Fight to the finish right here. These guys got some smoke yet, don't they? Nobody limping around out there too much. Double D, there he goes, he's running. Three thirty one, Jason Parker in that big white car. He got the biggest one out there. If he hits him, it'll make a mark. Number six, Mike Puckren. 283, Scott Tabernack. 36, Double D, Jeff Clark. 522, Jamie Stidham. Two seventy-two is Nathan Miller. And 331. Oh, we got him. That's Parker. Oh, look at 522. He had another big hit. He already got one mad dog. There he is. There's the winner of the mid-size, I mentioned. Good job. Oh, 522 missed them all, didn't they? Five, six guys look like they could go for a while. Oh, 522 is in the middle. They're coming at him from both sides. He got out of there. Good job. Now, ah, you don't want to hang around in there. Good job uh, hitting here now. Everybody is fighting her to the finish. Nobody's sandbagging out there. Oh, buddy. 272, look at him, he's gonna get him. Oh, nice shot. 272, Nathan Miller. Put it on Scott Devernack. And I mean, Scott's still feeling that one. He sakes, tore the bumper right off of it. He's got a harpoon sticking out the back. Look at that bumper folded back. That'd be bad to run in a driver window, wouldn't it? I think they folded it back for him. He's in better shape now. Oh, 
22 and 36, double D. Caught 331, Jason Parker in the middle. Still got a little giddy up, don't he? Uh oh. Oh, trying to take him to the wall. He did. Haven't seen anybody up on top of the wall yet tonight. It ain't over, though. Five twenty-two. Jamie Stidham got rammed into that wall, and he's not getting away yet. There he goes. Nice job. Two eighty-three did a nice job of avoiding a hit right there. That was Scott Devernack. Good job of driving. Oh, ran into that one, though. I'll tell you, there is nobody backing off right now. Everybody's in it to win it. Come out of there like a fighting sound. Mercy sakes. He's all, all six of these guys look strong. Thirty-six double D. Haven't heard much out of him lately. 522 still hammering away, isn't he? He's had a lot of big hits. That's Jamie Stidham at 522. Oh, we got a crowd over there. Oh, they're gonna like picking on these three guys. Got three in a huddle and three of them hitting them. This is way good. If you're one of the three on the outside, you're in good shape right now. They ought to be lining up. 331 got out. Jason Parker got out of there. He's trying, he's trying to get Jamie loosened up. Tell you what, that is hot steam coming out of there. You, you don't want to be the guy in front of that. That is hot, buddy. Oh, what's up with these two up at this end? They'd like 283 and uh, 272 to do something. There we go. This time to hit him in the driver door. What's the heck? They are all jammed up back here. We got about four of them tangled up. Two eighty-three. Scott Devernick would love to tangle another one in that mess. to get him pushed in there. 283, Scott Devernack, the only one that's running and loose. Everybody else is either tangled up or not running. And he's having a big time. This is Demo Luck here. 36 double D -E comes out. It's a two-man race now. somebody to hit them hard enough to loosen them up. Thirty 
286 Double D, Jeff Clark. 283 Scott Devernick. They're wailing it out. The others are all tangled up. The other guys are all running out of time. I don't know how we're going to know which one of those down there. We'll find out in the pack how those are going to sort out. These guys don't either one want to get too far away. If they get too far away, the other guy's going to hit them. There. Playing it close to the vest right now. Jeff Clark and 36 Double D with the upper hand. Now it's Scott Devernack pushing him. Both these cars still got a lot in them. else is out but these two right here everybody else is out of time I'll tell you what you got one picked out how many of you like the 283 Scott Devernick How about 36 Double D, Jeff Clark? Well, see how this goes. Both of them have been around demos for a while. They know what's going on and what's on the line. There's only one of those big trophies. Of course, with a big trophy comes the big check. This will be interesting right here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Didn't bend either one of them, I don't think. Uh-oh. Jeff Clark died. He's not running. Ouch. Now he's running. This is a good old good one right here. together I think they can get loose they just don't want to there they go there they are they're just being friendly I'll tell you what both of them are looking pretty good uh oh 36 double D not running, Jeff Clark. What in the world? Ah, oh, that might be a mistake that'll cost him right there. Looked to me like he should have wailed him for me. He wanted to go for the big hit. He wanted to get a run for the big hit, and it didn't work. These boys play for real, don't they? Neither one wants to get too far from the other. This is a feature will go down. They'll remember this one for a while. Oh, he got him over the wall. Jeff Clark got him to the wall, but he can't finish him off. Looks like Jeff Clark in the driver's seat now. There comes Scott right back at him. There comes Scott. 
God ain't liking that wall. You're gonna have to get away from there for a little bit. And going right back out to the center. Scott gains a little bit each time. There comes Scott taking Jeff to the wall. Murder Jason, I'm sorry. Gonna try something different. Jason. Jason lining up there. He got a good shot on him. These guys, these guys are playing for real. These aren't just little taps here, folks. They're shaking them even with those hits. Boys are gonna be sore tomorrow. They'll probably be back here Saturday to go again. Next Saturday, another demo right here. <laughs> they just won't quit. One of them probably run out of gas here for too long. I doubt if they get real good mileage. Well, there's nothing seems to be phasing them. Oh, now, if he can... If Jason can get him back there and tangle him up with one of those, that might be the plan now. Jason trying to get him back there and maybe tangle him up with one of the others, but nothing hooking on to him yet. Which one do you like, Manny? I'm going to go with 36 double D. You would be a double D girl. That would be Jason Parker. Oh, Scott Devernick, is, he's been good all night in that 283. We'll see. I'll take 283 and you take 36 double D. All right. All right. Winner gets the French fries. Winner gets the leftover French fries. All right, sounds there good. You go. Got a bet on now. This is serious stuff. Double D, Scott Devernack, and he's from Columbia no, Station. That's 283. 36 Double D is Jeff Clark. Jeff Clark, 36 Double D. Yeah, you said Jason Parker. Yeah. yeah. I don't know what I got down here. Yeah, there we go. Parker's 331. Jeff Clark is the 36 Double D. I apologize, Jeff. I was looking at the wrong J down there. But anyway. Uh-oh. Here we go. Yeah. Jeff Clark got the best of that one. He did a little damage there. Scott Drevenick in the 283 felt that last one. That's why they didn't want to get too far apart. Something like that was going to happen. But he's still running. That is Jeff Clark from Plain City in the 36 double D. I was giving Jason Parker way too much credit. He's over there in the mix up. Scott, give 
and Jeff a ride now. Oh, buddy. They're right behind my post. Do you remember way back when when the 283 car was almost by himself and everybody else was tangled up? We thought it was about over. And then Jeff Clark got out of there and it's been a fight ever since. I don't believe Scott's running. There he got going. Scott Devernick, too, I'll tell you what. Up until he got in that corner, it was anybody's contest. My land. Well, if I had a pretty blonde hugging me like that, I might have tried it. <laughs> I never thought about that. Mercy. How about that? Don't forget another demo right here next Saturday. In the meantime, tractor pull on Monday.